Hey, what's up? I'm Miles Kennedy. And I'm Mark Tremonti from Alter Bridge. And you're watching Loudwire. The first single, Show Me a Leader, uh, we're playing it very often on Loudwire nights. I know the video is at the top of the Battle Royale countdown over at loudwire.com, so congratulations. Thank you. What can you tell us about that song musically and lyrically? Um, musically, I remember getting together with Miles and um, we put together our ideas like puzzle pieces almost, so I'll throw out my favorite ideas, he'll do the same. And um, I had a chorus I really loved and I played it for Miles and he was playing me a few days later, maybe, the intro part that I l fell in love with. And um, I think uh, that's what made that song special, was having those two pieces um, put together. And from there, we just the song came together kind of in the last moment in pre-production. And, uh, and Miles ran with, the, um, with the, the theme of the song. Yeah, and as far as what that song is about, um, it, was, it was basically a reaction to, to I think a, a, a feeling that a lot of people are feeling right now and just kind of questioning and feeling disillusioned with um, leaders and um, uh, you know it, it's, it's not, a, it's not a, 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 a sta we're not taking a stance on something we're not saying this side's right or this side's right or you know we don't have an agenda that's where, that was really important because we're just not a political band but, but it, 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 the, it was becoming so Deafening the volume of, of this like campaign seasons and and um, it was hard to shut that out. And I remember I, I woke up one morning staying at Mark's house when we were doing pre-production, and um, the TV was on in the other room. And it, somebody was you know selling their wares. One of one of the one of the uh, um, people vying for the job, as they say, and um, the line. So they're selling another Messiah here tonight. Came to, came to my mind, and then I just wrote the lyrics. I mean, it came really quickly from that point forward. But yeah, it's just, it's kind of just gauging everybody's emotions, reflection of how we feel right now, that disillusionment. Okay. Um, another song that was just released is My Champion and Miles. You said the song was inspired by your youth as a small, underdeveloped kid, <laughs> and you got a, you know, a lot of encouragement from teachers, coaches, family. Uh, is there a particular story that you can share with us that truly resonates with the lyrics of the song? Um, I don't know if there's a particular story. I mean, I, I think to kind of highlight how it was for me, I, felt, I guess I felt so different and so um, alienated. You know, when you're a kid, you want to fit in. You want to feel like your peers. And, it, and I was such a late bloomer, I, I don't think I really hit puberty until I was like almost 17. <laughs> so I was, really, I was really small and my voice didn't change. And, and I, I still don't think it's changed actually. Still can barely grow facial hair. Um, uh, but uh, I'd, go to, I'd go to dinner with my family, my parents, and I mean, I'm 16 years old, 15, 16 years old, and I sit down and the waitress is still giving me the children's menu. You know, it sucked. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, so yeah, it was just tough keeping up. And so the words of encouragement that my, my mom would give me or, or, you know, teachers, some of those things really stuck with me. And um, so I think that my champion, though, though they're not the exact things they told me, it's just the idea uh, and, and put it to a lyric and, um, you know, hopefully people will find comfort in that who might feel the same way for any, for any little undeveloped folks out there. <laughs> and for the record, I see facial hair. Oh, okay, well, there's a little bit. I, I tape it on every morning. <laughs> okay. It's not real. The title track, The Last Hero, is nearly seven minutes long. It's the last song on the album, and I know you don't want to get into the theme too much, but right. how does it kind of wrap up and put a nice bow on the concept? Mm, well, um... I think that it, it definitely um, expresses that desperation and that longing for a hero or leadership. And um, it takes a look at a number of dynamics, one of which is what we tend to do to the people that we do put in that position and how we build them up and we, we tear them down. And it's just, it's, um, it, to me, it's, it's fascinating how humans tend to do that. I don't understand why we do that. It's almost like we're not. It's almost like we're not content once we find those people. We've got to find their flaws and then, and then, um, you know, move on to the next one. Uh, but um, 
But yeah, that 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 song. I think it could apply to a number of a number of things and other and a number of, of people that um, we've elevated to that level. Mm -hmm.